Hello everyone, welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. In Friday's episode of Emmerdale, Will Taylor is in despair after his daughter Dawn Taylor informs him that she needs to call Rose about baby Avon's emergency. It's reasonable to say that the Taylor-Tate family has gone through several conflicts in recent months. Don's young son even was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia, ALL, and she also had to deal with the sudden presence of her estranged mother, Rose. Rose re-established her relationship with Don and started to form the family tie she had always desired when she relocated to home farm. However, there was a dark secret behind her arrival. She was working with Ruby Fox Milligan to destroy Kim Tate's life, and she even slept with her married ex-Will as part of the scheme. Kim quickly caught on to Rose's scheme, and she went missing after being abandoned in the middle of nowhere by Kim and Will. After the couple drove away, a mysterious car approached Rose and fled, leaving her belongings by the side of the road. Don is frightened about her mother's disappearance, and Will is terrified that his secret one-night stand will be revealed, as well as the fact that he and Kim were the last to see her. The issue worsens when Don informs Will that even may require a bone marrow transplant and that he should contact Rose. Will is stunned by Don's bombshell and filled with dread as he recovers Rose's phone and listens to Don's voicemail. As he tries to call Kim again, a guilt-ridden Will leaves a message on Rose's phone. How far will he go to protect his dark secret? In Monday's episode, Emmerdale's Will Taylor discovers the truth about what happened to missing Rose. Will has been falling apart since his ex Rose inexplicably vanished after he and his wife Kim Tate abandoned her in the middle of nowhere. Not only is he haunted by Rose's disappearance, but he is also scared that their secret one-night stand will be revealed and ruin everything. After Rose's plan to destroy Kim was revealed, Will and Kim expelled her from the village by abandoning her and drove away, but she was never seen again. Will worried when Don Taylor stated she wanted to contact her missing mother because even would need a bone marrow transplant and went to extraordinary lengths to avoid suspicion, texting Don on Rose's phone. Will's deception, however, is finally exposed as the truth about Rose's fate is revealed through a sequence of flashbacks. Is Rose still alive? Meanwhile, Kane Dingle is impressed when he sees John Sugden working with a major farming client, but things quickly become heated when Kane confronts Moira Dingle about the alcohol he discovered in her luggage. Moira has been struggling since the illegal arrest and imprisonment of her son Maddie Barton, who was accused of stabbing Samson Dingle. Although Maddie has since been released and Samson imprisoned, the event has caused strain in her marriage to Kane, and she has been exhibiting troubling behavior toward her loved ones. The tragic reality was soon revealed. Moira had evidently turned to booze to cope with her problems, but can Kane stop his wife before she spirals into alcoholism again? Chess Dingle is curious as her brother Caleb Milligan and Jay Sharma celebrate their new deal. What are the unscrupulous merchants up to? In Tuesday's episode of Emmerdale, Moira Dingle's behavior worsens. Moira has been dealing with a difficult situation after her son Maddie Barton was sentenced to prison for allegedly stabbing Samson Dingle. Although Samson finally admitted his lies about the ordeal and Maddie was released, she has difficult to forgive the Dingle family for not supporting her son. The farmer has been continuously bickering with her husband, Kane Dingle, and her strange behavior, including outbursts and sudden lethargy, has raised concerns. Moira, who battled substance misuse three years ago, had been secretly drinking again to cope with her inner pain when Kane questioned her about the whiskey he discovered in her luggage. Moira's attitude becomes concerning when Kane notices her using painkillers, but an irritated Moira responds by pointing out the unopened bottle of scotch. Later, she confides in John Sugden that she is concerned about her marriage. 
Meanwhile, Nate Robinson is startled when Kane confronts him about his relationship with former lover Moira after catching them drinking together. Nate is hurt as he argues with his father that their relationship is on good terms. However, he is anxious when Kane leaves to see the children. Since his divorce from Laurel Thomas, resentful Jay Sharma has reverted to his nasty ways and is causing trouble for Caleb Milligan. Jay is irritated when Caleb requests more money to bribe their council contact, and he offers a strong warning not to be messed with. Chas Dingle isn't convinced by Jay and Caleb's relationship, so her brother goes out to cause havoc at home James Hollage. What's Caleb up to now? As Jay mocks Victoria Sugden for attempting to change a spare tire, John plays the protective brother and confronts an intimidated Jay. Emmerdale fans were shocked to learn that Belle Dingle's dog Piper is still alive, despite Tom King's falsehoods that she was dead, but they were outraged. In an unexpected twist that will astound Emmerdale fans, Belle Dingle's beloved dog Piper has been deceptively portrayed as a goner by her unscrupulous husband Tom. The reality was tragically revealed in Wednesday's nail-biting episode, in which Tom King, played by actor James Chase, coldly gives Piper over to an unwary couple under the guise of giving the dog a new start. Little did they know, they were being duped into stealing Belle's dog, while she is completely unaware that Piper is still alive. Wednesday night's drama kept viewers glued to their televisions as the evil Tom used Piper as the latest tool in his sick campaign to rule Belle. In Monday's heartbreaking episode, the situation appeared bleak for the beloved canine after a car accident nearly killed him. According to the Daily Star, this left Piper clinging to life while Tom and Rona Goskirk fought to save her. Belle was on edge, wanting to comfort Piper, when Tom cruelly informed her that their beloved pet had died. Belle, in tears, said farewell to Piper as the vet prepared what appeared to be the dog's final shot. However, Belle's suspicions are growing, as she suspects Tom's so-called accident was anything but, and she is piecing together the unpleasant reality of his evil proclivities. Tom cornered Belle in a terrifying standoff, even attempting to persuade her that the abuse was all in her head. Despite everything, Belle holds firm, confronting Tom and seeking police assistance while using Claire's law to determine whether Tom has a history of domestic abuse. The hit ITV soap received a slew of Ofcom complaints after Piper the dog seemed to be murdered by Tom in previous episodes. Soap fans were injured by scenes in which Tom ran over Belle's beloved dog in an attempt to further manipulate his estranged wife. Viewers vented their rage on social media, with many claiming they had stopped watching the show entirely owing to the upsetting occurrences. The episode, which aired on August 16, and contained the unsettling incident in which Tom ran over Piper in a desperate attempt to reconnect with Belle, received 183 complaints. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below, and if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.